Hello friends, so I thought it was time for another um, just little live chat, little update video. Please ignore the fact that I have not made my bed. I just got out of it five minutes ago to set up my new tripod. It's little things in life, you know. Uh, so it has been two months of me living on my own. It's been okay. I no longer have a cast. For all the weirdos out there that keep making casty comments and all my things. All right, you guys want to hear a story? Because, buddy, I got a story for you. So, when I post my stuff about my cast, which is not very often. Um, <laughs> so, the first time I ever posted it on Instagram. Sorry, I'm like looking at myself and not like the actual part I should be looking at. So if it feels like I'm talking to a mirror, that is basically what I'm doing. Just know that everything is towards you guys. I'm just watching to make sure I don't have like a booger or, you know, spit. Anyways, so I posted on my blog Instagram about having a cast the one day because I had written a blog about it and I used hashtags like broken foot, cast life because I don't know, that's just what the post was about. If I post about makeup, I'm gonna use makeup hashtags. If it's a personal post, I put like personal post hashtag. If it's food, I put food. I just didn't even think about it. So I just did, you know, broken foot, foot cast. I was like, you know, maybe like, I don't know. But let me tell you, the messages that I got, buddy, if I can figure out how to insert them, this is where I will do it. Oh my goodness, cast fetish is a thing. It is a thing, mama. It. And I only posted that like a week before I got it off. Like you're telling me I could have been stacking in the racks and making them bills of these cast people and I didn't know. I could have made so much money. So anyway, so I'm not gonna lie, it like weirded me out. And then when I started posting on YouTube, two of my videos have in the title, Broken Foot Update, and I got my cast off, and people started commenting on those about cast things, and I'm sure they're going to come to this one too, because I'm probably going to title this one, The Story of My Tail. And it was, I was just shocked. I was like, I guess this is a thing. I didn't know this. It's a little strange to me, not gonna lie, but hey man, you do you as long as you're not hurting anyone. I mean, so that was like a few weeks ago and over time, like I still get like a few messages here and there and I'm just like, <laughs> it's just odd to me. So most of the time I don't reply to them. But then the other night I was talking to my friend and I was like, I should like, see if I can make money off this. Like I have a lot of cast pictures like on my phone. Like I don't have the cast anymore, but like I got a lot of messages asking. So we thought it'd be funny if I tried to make an OnlyFans for my cast. <laughs> so I made an OnlyFans account and I put every single cast picture that I had up there. I put captions for them all. There's 22 posts in total, ranging in price. You could follow me for free, but you had to pay per picture. And not only that, I then sent the link to everyone who had messaged me and I tried to make a separate Instagram account specifically to promote it. Well, let me tell you, you give the people what they want, which is cast pictures, and they go the extra mile, and then they suddenly just want your cast. Honey, I don't have the cast. I got it up three weeks ago. 
So unfortunately, I gained two followers, but zero dollars. Nope. No. Nobody wanted it anymore. It was too late. I should have learned. I should have. I don't know. I didn't think of this. But I didn't give the people what they wanted. And when I tried, they just wanted more. What can you do? Can't hate the player or the game or the customers. Can't, you know, just time and man. I don't, I don't know. I, don't, I just don't know. So, it didn't work. Unfortunately. But those are all, they're all deleted now, so. And I didn't take screenshots, so you guys are going to have to take my word for it. Uh, so what else is new and exciting? I got some nails again. I'm getting a tattoo tomorrow. She's trying to be herself again. I have been very, oddly, I have been very depressed since getting my cast off. Um, I mean, I was, I've been like depressed the whole time, but um, the past like few weeks, I don't know what it is. I just like every day, I just, I'm like, well, what a beautiful day to stay in bed and watch TV and just text people and avoid everything in life. But no, I shouldn't say that. I have been trying to go out a decent amount and I'm very lucky that the few friends that I do have here are very good ones and they drag me out when I'm not feeling so hot. So, thanks guys if you watch this. Uh, Halloween. Halloween was fun. I was a scene queen, so I didn't look much different. We just went to like a little small party at Wyatt's house and it was fun. I'm sorry, I feel like this update's like pretty boring, but um, yeah, I've just been trying to organize my place a lot. I guess you can't really tell because my bed looks the last thing from organized. It literally looks like not organized, but the rest of my place is and uh, yeah it's been nice here the past few days so I should try and get out and enjoy the last few days of decent weather because everyone keeps uh, warning me that apparently the winters here are brutal and I hate winter so I can't wait for that anyways so that is the tale of how I tried to make an OnlyFans for my cast But you know what? She tried. And that's all you can do sometimes. <laughs> I'm gonna keep this one short because all my videos are always wicked long. Okay.